in the arena about an hour and a half ago is the Lamont Marcel Jacobs, the Italian Olympic champion from last year in the 100 and the 4x100, has pulled out of this 100 metres. Real shock and big disappointment for the meeting organisers and the crowd, of course, but it's still a very strong field. There is Joris Van Hul of the Netherlands. Van Hul who is a late replacement, it has to be said, because uh, he wasn't in the original lineup. Rohan Browning ran the heats of the Italian Championships in Rieti on Saturday, the Australian, ran 10.32 there, a semi-finals of the last Commonwealth Games. He goes in two. Henrik Larsson of Sweden goes in lane three. Larsson, European under-23 champion back in 2019. He's seven times the Swedish champion, a building force, best of 10.20 from a couple of years back. Jupan Abekun of uh, Sri Lanka, goes in lane four. He was uh, fifth in Oslo a couple of weeks back. National record, a lot of them. Akane Simbine of South Africa. He goes in lane five, right in the centre of this field. Fourth in Tokyo last year, fourth in the last World Championships. He's the Commonwealth champion. He won easily uh, four years ago in the Gold Coast. There is Reese Prescott, European Championship silver medalist back in 2018. Nickname is British Bolt. Finished... Uh, second in the UK Championships just last weekend. Jimmy Vico goes in seventh, seventh in Rio back in uh, 2016. Third in the French Championships at Caen on Saturday in 10.24. He is the national record holder, Vico. He goes in uh, seven. And Mohamed Oufal of France completes the lineup. He goes in lane eight. Won the French Championships on Saturday, beating Vico in 10.19 with zero wins. Well, what a shame. And what Marcel Jacobs couldn't come out. We understand he had a scan last night, felt some discomfort, a little bit of discomfort, and I pro think probably feels that these next two weeks, a further recovery, a bit of training, will get him in shape for those world championships. Why jeopardise that for a run here tonight? But a huge disappointment not to see him there. Rohan Browning goes in lane two with Van Hool in one. Larson in three, Abikun in four. Watch Simbine in five, the South African. Reese Prescott, the Briton, in six. Vico, seven fall in lane eight. Sit. Quite a long hold there and left in the blocks, I think, was Abi Kuhn in the orange. Going very well at the moment is Simbine. Simbine leading. Prescott trying to come back at him. Is he going to get there? No. Simbine stays well clear. Wins by metre from Prescott. And I think Jimmy Vico might have taken third place in that yellow vest on the near side. The winning time, 10-0-2. Into a slight headwind. Minus 0.5. Steve, that would probably have been a sub-10 if he'd had a, a little bit of a tailwind behind him. But Simbine, very quick out of the blocks. He's a great start to this fella. Very, very consistent too. I like to call him the nearly man. He was fifth in Rio 2016, fifth in London 2017. Then he won the Commonwealth in 2018, fourth in the World Championships in 2019, fourth in the Olympic Games last year. He's got so many great races behind him, but uh, maybe, just maybe, this will be his summer. Could be, Tim, could be. Still, uh, I think, uh, chances for somebody. This was all done in the first 10, 15 metres. Uh, Prescott had to get out with him. He didn't quite get on terms with him. And Simbine, you know, I was impressed this time. Sometimes he doesn't finish off as well as you would like if you're talking about him getting into the medals or getting close to the medals. And maybe that's why it's been fifths and fourths. He can start. He can get out really well. And the, tonight, though, he really drives all the way through. Prescott never got on terms with him. And uh, there you see the result of that. Well, win of a 10-0-2. Comfortable win, too, for Zimbino over Prescott. And Vico, it was, who took third place. Prescott, one of two Brits selected in the 100 metres, along with Zarnell Hughes, the uh, European champion for Eugene in that particular distance. But, uh, yeah, Akane Simbine goes from strength to strength. And that actually, a season's best, 10-0-2. It was 10-0-6. He has run 9.84. That was uh, last year.